What's going on? Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Today, I'm going to show you how to get into real estate with absolutely zero dollars up front. No experience, no good credit, no prior knowledge. None of that stuff is going to be necessary or required to utilize this method that I've been using since 2018. Guys, my name is Rhonda. I am a serial entrepreneur. I've been doing the real estate game with the big boys. I've been in the rooms. I've been in the field and I have learned how to manipulate the market in a way that is best for the new person, right? In 2018, I was just like you. I was on YouTube. I was looking for a way to get into real estate without having to get a license because I just didn't want to commit the time. I didn't want to commit to going to class and doing all those things. So I realized that it was one way and the only way to get into real estate with absolutely nothing was utilizing wholesale real estate. I did my first deal in 30 days and I made $30,000. Guys, it was phenomenal. It was amazing. And it blew my mind to the point where I knew that this was for me. Now today I make YouTube videos just like this, showing people how to get into the real estate game easy. No prior knowledge, no money, no experience. None of that stuff matters, right? You can do this today. And in this video, I'm going to show you step by step on how to do it so you can close your first deal in the next 30 days. Look, stick with me, stay with me, and I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. At the end of the video, if you have any questions, click the link below and schedule a free discovery call, okay? Free discovery call, cost you nothing, get on the phone with me, ask me questions, get help, get answers, and I'll see you at the end of the video. All right, guys, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First things first, we're gonna be using Zillow.com, okay? Zillow.com, it's absolutely free. And what we're gonna do is come right here to the middle and we're gonna put a city, a town, a state, whatever it is, right? Let's say I wanna do Orange, Texas. Orange, Texas is about 45 minutes from me. So always think about things are, that are drivable to your area, things that you can get to where people were located, things like that, right? So I'm gonna do Orange, Texas. Um, I've done North Carolina. I've done everywhere you could probably think of, all right? So let's go Orange, Texas. I like this place. It's small, a small town. Next thing we're gonna do is go up here for sale for rent or sold, we're gonna go for sale. Then we're gonna keep this at 100,000. Again, you can use different numbers, but I like to start around the $100,000 mark, all right? Next thing, bed and bath, just leave it open, doesn't matter right now. Then home type, come in here and select only houses, not townhomes or anything else. Today, we're only talking about houses. Now here's the magic, don't skip this step, right here. It says more, come down and make sure that you click buy owner and other, buy owner and other. Uncheck anything else on this screen. It doesn't matter, none of that matters. What matters is right here, buy owner, okay? Buy owner, once you have that, we hit apply and now you're gonna see the options, okay? Right now I have one option, that's a for sale um, by owner, it's been on here for 35 days. Now, the reason why I like by owner is because you're gonna be talking directly to the owner and not like a realtor or anything like that. Now, they don't have a ton of pictures. Um, I can see from here, the grass is overgrown. Um, it looks like the house to the left, maybe needs some work, house to the right. I can't really tell, it was blocked behind trees. But look, it's $75,000 is the asking price. Now, the fact that it's been on here for 35 days, gives me a little leverage because the owner has had it listed and they haven't sold it yet. So the longer it sits, the more leverage you have, all right? So scroll down and you're gonna see 35 days on Zillow, 160 reviews, two saves, whatever, whatever, right? So here is the number for the owner. Here's the number right here for the owner in front of your face, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in, take this address, and we're going to just save it, you know, into a file or folder, or whatever the case may be. And then you're going to Put it right here and call the person, right? Pick up the phone, call the person, leave them a voicemail, a text message, and let them know that you're interested in the property, all right? So now, guys, now that we've done that, you've seen it kind of in flow, and I want to now show you some things um, that I, I do, right? I'm going to walk you through my process, right? So the exact same thing. Um, we got another one that popped up right here. It's 75800 Let's see what this one is, right? So we got this, okay, got some pictures. It does look like it needs some work, right? If you look at the pictures, you can see that it's kind of like in the woods and needs a little bit of work. On the inside, it definitely needs work, okay? This is what we call an opportunity, all right? So this one is in a place called Vider, Texas. So it may have just been when I tapped the map, it moved over, but this is no problem, right? It's in Vider, Texas. 
Uh, let's see. Boom. Take a look. Here's a two bed, one bath, 988 square feet. Cool. It's been on the market seven days. Again, there's that owner's information. I like this. You know, I like things that look like this. Okay. So I'm going to take this address and then I'm going to go into a, another website that's absolutely free called truepeoplesearch.com. Truepeoplesearch.com. You can skip trace, right? It's called skip trace and go right here to address. Take this, take this out. And here it goes right here, Vider, Texas. Now, this isn't a situation where maybe the information wasn't here or you're trying to make sure that this is the owner. This is just an extra piece that I like to do if the information's not there, okay? So you can come in here. This is gonna tell you the owner's name, their age, their address, phone numbers, all that stuff, okay? But here's the real secret, right? This is my favorite tool. And if you don't get this tool, I promise you it's gonna make your job a lot harder, okay? This one is called propstream.com. Now the link in the description below this video is going to give you a seven day free trial of propstream.com. Just click the link below, utilize it. Please, please, please do not skip this. All right, so we're gonna take that address and we're gonna put it right here. That's gonna come up. And then this is gonna help us get some information about this property, all right? It's gonna tell me there's no open mortgages, um, estimated equity is about 93,000, no liens. Um, there's public records open, it's a, a warranty deed, right? Comps at glance, comps means the houses in the area that have sold, average sale about $3,000, because it looks like a wooded area, so it's probably because of that reason why a lot of it's just land sales, okay? And this home looks like it may have been like just come something that's there. Okay. So now just kind of going down to guys, this is all public information, nothing hidden, nothing a secret. Okay. So boom, we see what, this is the owner right here, the owner, literally the owner's name. So when I call them, I can uh, address them as such. Okay. So here we go. Carport wood. It tells you all the information here. Estimated land value, 38, 3,800, just like it said. So now it says uh, assessed land value 38 and then improvement means the building that's on the property. So it's estimated at around 42.5 and we already kind of know what that house being the way that it is, the owner asking for 75 is extremely high. Okay, so we can you know use this information for conversation um, to make sure that you know what you're working with, know what's going on in that area. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick up the phone and I am going to call this owner, which we know the name right here, right? Thomas, right? Thomas, we know that. Mr. Mrs. Thomas, I was calling about your property at 120 Clare Road in Vider, Texas, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and give this person a call so you can hear it live. Hi, you reached Donna Hudson. Please leave your name and number in a brief message or shoot me a text message if you'd like a softer response. Thank you. Hello, Ms. Donna Hudson. My name is Rhonda. I was actually calling about your property at 120 Clare Road in Vider, Texas. Um, if you could give me a call back, I just had some questions. I see it listed here on Zillow and just want to get some confirmation before I make the ride out. Please give me a call back at your earliest convenience. And I'm also going to send you a text message to follow up as well. Thank you. All right, guys. So you just heard me leave that message. I'm going to leave a text message as well. I'm going to put it up on the screen so you can see the text message. Now, when I left the text message, she immediately started to text back. We started to have a conversation, but this is as simple as it gets. You don't have to overthink this. You don't have to be a professional or pro. You don't have to say the right or wrong terms. Just send the message and let them know your intentions, okay, guys? So it's as simple as Zillow.com, first step. Zillow.com, first step. Propstream.com. Again, link in the bio for the free, free, free. If you don't want the free, it's $97 a month after the seven day trial. But if you want to use it for the seven days, test it out, see if it's for you. Okay, guys, this is it. It's Zillow, it's PropStream, and True People Search. Understand, there's no magic, there's nothing hard. It's just about the work. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that I made it simple. If you have any questions, click the link in the description, set up your free free, free discovery call, and I'll talk to you soon.